Let's imagine you're sitting down at a table about to eat your favorite meal. What's on your plate? Is it a fruit or vegetable? A source of protein like chicken nuggets or a hamburger? A grain like noodles, rice, or bread? Or maybe it's a sugary, sweet dessert. Did any of you think of sorghum? No, probably not. You're going to start seeing more sorghum in your school meals, which is why we'll be talking about what sorghum is, where it's grown, how it's grown, and how it's used to make delicious and healthy meals. Okay, first things first. What is sorghum? Sorghum is a grain, and grains are actually the seeds of plants that we eat as food. Wheat, corn, oats, and rice are also grains that you're probably most used to eating. Sorghum was first grown thousands of years ago, so it's considered an ancient grain. Where do you think sorghum originated from? Was it A. Europe B. Africa C. Australia If you guessed Europe, sorry, it's actually Africa. Now, what country do you think grows the most sorghum in the world? Is it A. United States B. China C. Ethiopia That's right! It's the United States! Sorghum is grown in an area of the U.S. called the Sorghum Belt. Where do you think that's located on this map? The Sorghum Belt covers a pretty big area. It starts in South Dakota and goes through Nebraska, Kansas, Colorado, Oklahoma, and Texas. Sorghum grows in the ground, like corn or wheat. Maybe you've seen these crops growing around where you live. Sorghum farmers plant seeds in the spring and harvest the grain in the fall. One of the best parts about sorghum is it's super sustainable and environmentally friendly. First, it uses less water than similar crops. That's important because we need water to grow our food, but we also need to conserve it. Sorghum also takes carbon dioxide from the air. Carbon dioxide is a gas that's in the air all around us, and too much of it can be harmful to the earth. Plants like sorghum are especially good at taking carbon dioxide out of the air and storing it in their root systems. Lastly, sorghum is used to make biofuel, which is a type of fuel that's made from plants or other living things instead of oil or gas. Biofuels release less pollution into the air and help protect the environment. And these are only a few of the many reasons why sorghum is great for the earth. So we now know that sorghum is an environmentally friendly ancient grain. But how is sorghum used to make delicious and healthy meals? Well, sorghum can be used in a lot of different ways. One of the most common ways to eat it is in whole grain, like you would with rice or quinoa. Sorghum can be ground into flour to be used in breads, muffins, cookies, crackers, or other baked goods. It can also be popped like popcorn. You can find sorghum as an ingredient in granola bars, cereals, chips, and more. Sorghum is becoming more and more popular because of its nutritional benefits. It's a plant-based protein that's high in fiber and antioxidants, which are important for a healthy diet. Plus, it's naturally gluten-free, which makes it a perfect whole grain option for people who do not eat gluten. Now, let's play a game. Which one has more protein? One serving of whole grain sorghum or a serving of quinoa? One serving of cooked whole grain sorghum has more than double the amount of protein than a serving of quinoa. Which one has more iron? One serving of whole grain sorghum or a three ounce sirloin steak? One half cup serving of cooked whole grain sorghum has nearly double the iron as a three ounce sirloin steak. Which one has more vitamin B6? One serving of whole grain sorghum or one serving of spinach? Believe it or not, you'd have to eat more than seven cups of raw spinach to get the same amount of vitamin B6 in one half cup serving of cooked whole grain sorghum. 
Wow, we've covered a lot of information about sorghum today. So, let's review. Sorghum is an ancient grain that originated in Africa thousands of years ago. The United States produces the most sorghum in the world, and it is mostly grown in the sorghum belt. Sorghum is an incredibly sustainable crop. Sorghum has many nutritional benefits and can be eaten in a variety of ways. Now that you're an expert on sorghum, go try it out. Ask your parents to try a new sorghum recipe or use sorghum instead of another grain like rice and be on the lookout for sorghum in your school's meals.